Hello, Maurice Malone here from Wing Fur Garment Company, the nation's leading denim alteration specialist. Today, I'm gonna to explain the two different ways the denim industry measures the waist on jeans. When reviewing measurement charts online, it's important to recognize which techniques are being used when reviewing the measurement charts from a merchant. So first we're gonna cover what's called the relaxed method. And it's called the relaxed method because you're basically laying the jeans on the table, flat and relaxed. You're gonna pull a little gathering out of the jeans, put them kind of firm. Then we're gonna measure from point to point. Here you see that this measures about 17 and a half. If you double that, you get 35 inches. So the waist measurement would be 35 inches and a relaxed waist technique. Now this next technique is called measuring along the top edge. We're gonna simply put the edges of the, the top edge of the waistband together like this. Pull it, lay it flat. Again, you wanna pull out the gathers. And as you can see, this measures about 18 inches, which will be 36 inches. And depending on the size, this one's the size 34, is usually about an inch to an inch and a half difference on the total circumference. Now, while we're on the subject of measuring the waist, I'm gonna clear up a few misconceptions. The waist size doesn't necessarily equal the waist measurement. Uh, that's because jeans are usually worn on your hips. Uh, unless we're talking about like a high-waisted jean, uh, most commonly women's jeans, uh, high-waisted jean is going to sit exactly on the waistline, and that's when like the waist measurement and the waist size are going to equal the same number. 